Welcome to the Formula Live. Uh, it's my pleasure to have Jason Jung here. He is a professional tennis player. Uh, he plays internationally. His ranking right now stands at 390, which is great. I have met him about two years ago, and uh, we're going to show you a about three key exercises to help strengthen his professional tennis game. So um, he'll share with you at the very end why he feels that Pilates is a huge influence in his professional game. And um, we're going to show you the power through the glutes, the endurance, the stamina, range of motion in the rotator cuff uh, range and shoulders, and then take you to the back end and of course combine the lats and the side lateral for all of his hitting and swinging. So first things first, we'll start with the glutes. Jason's going to get into quadruped and externally rotate his left foot, bringing his toes towards the edge of the jump board, and he's going to start to jump. So he's going to inhale out, exhale. So he's externally rotating his left leg, which means flexibility in his left hip joint, where his stabilizer is driving through his right glute. He's not putting all of his body weight into his hands because he knows that his abs are there to hold him in, not his joints and his ligaments and tendons. So Jason's now going to transition into donkey kicks, where he brings his toes really close to the bottom of the platform so he doesn't compromise his knee when he jumps. So we're hitting external rotation, we're hitting parallel and donkey, and now he's going to combine the two. He opens, inhale, exhale on exertion launch, inhale in, exhale on exertion donkey. So then, once again, he's used to turning and playing and using his side laterals, using his glute flexibility and his psoas, his hip flexors, all the above. And this, of course, helps his power on the court. So perfect, Jason, go ahead and come down slowly for that one. Next, he'll grab both of his handles and put them into his hands. He's going to sit upright. He's going to think about his chest over position, roll his shoulders back, pull his leg ribcage together, pelvic tilt so he's not fall forward. Inhale, exhale, or tower straight up into the sky. As lifted, out to a T and bring it down. Good, inhale, exhale, come straight up. Range of motion for the shoulder, deltoids, rhomboids, lats. Stability in his thoracic spine, yet he's not compromising his cervical nor his traps. He uses his exhale on his tower, inhale, wraps it back around and down. Perfect, now he's going to switch directions, go out to a T first, out, and slowly bring it forward, controlling it once again with his rectus abdominis, his transverse, his pelvic tilt, so his pelvic floor, everything works together to get him to where he needs to be. One more, inhale, exhale, range of motion up, Inhale, full range of motion down and the chest rest. Strap on the shoulder rest. Last but not least, he will face you and we will grab him the three pound weight. Left foot is going to hook in the floor strap here. This is the traditional side overs from classical Pilates. He makes sure that his step, hips are completely stepped. Hang on to this. Your right hand can now palpate your left side ladder on which you're going to use. He's going to stretch his left leg as long as he can like I'm pulling on a rubber band. There's lots of intention there. Jason's going to lengthen out with control. Inhale, lengthen from his left side lateral. Lift up and pull up. So inhale one, inhale two, exhale three, then exhale lift up for four. For just 10 seconds today, we're just giving you an idea of what these minutes ultimately look like. So inhale, inhale, exhale, exhale on exertion. So after, say, you know, 45 seconds, we hold him here, and he just waves his arm. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. So he's working, what? Hip stability, side lateral, oblique work, and of course his lat, while relaxing his traps and his shoulders. And then he can just take it to the floor and stretch, rest, both hands can come to the floor. This is amazing back opener. It's a great side lateral opener. He's feeling it through his hips. His left foot is still flexed, and he's allowed to relax and open up what he just strengthened. So I'll let Jason come on up carefully and then just give his feedback on why he keeps coming back after two years. Well, luckily I've been coming back here for two years to see Jasmine. Just because tennis is such a court oriented sport and you use your glutes and a lot of people think girls come here all the time but it's actually a great workout for me. It gets everything I need without all the heavy weights and Jasmine's great. So thank you for joining us today. I love it when Jason pops in because I always try and get the girls and the other men to keep up with him and shout him out in class. And I'm just grateful that he is here and he, he keeps coming back. So thank you for joining us. Have a wonderful Saturday and we hope to see him in Wimbledon soon at the US Open.